from Team Plaza's Finest uh, here for a deck review and maybe a game. So uh, today we're re reviewing Mill Tank Butterfree. So uh, the deck is pretty easy to set up and the concept is pretty simple. So uh, first Pokemon is Dredagon. It can handle um, Black Hiram, uh, Rayquaza EX. It just responds to those Dragon type weaknesses with his revenge for uh, DC. Then we have uh, the heart and soul of the deck, No Tank. He could hit for um, 80 damage when Butterfree is out. So um, this kind of just the synergy between them. Uh, but you do need to get Butterfree out. The way to do it is uh, really, really easy. Uh, Caterpie and Metapod have this really cool ability, Adaptive Evolution. This Pokemon can evolve during your first turn or the turn you play it. So, you can get Butterfree out first turn, and if you're going second, you can Powerful Friends for either 80, or if you have a Muscle Band or a Silver Bangle, you can do 100 or 110. So, um, that's pretty cool. And then we have uh, Brizian to block uh, Special Conditions and uh, it's a hard counter to um, the notoriously evil and rage-worthy deck, Trevenant Excelgore. Um, so now we just go to the items. Uh, we have four bike just for um, consistency to draw some cards when we don't have a when we want to just get four cards in our hand. Uh, level ball to search out um, Caterpie Metapod. Uh, one super rod to get back some energy or some Pokemon. Two switch uh, if we have something stuck in the active and we don't want it there. Uh, just play switch and it's not there anymore. Tell map. We would um, see our prizes. It's uh, pretty good first turn or second or third because you can just uh, use it, see what's prized, and then you can take the prizes, the prizes that you want. So we have four Ultra Ball to um, get everything else out of the deck. Brazilian, no tank, Butterfree, Dragon. We got two Colruses. Um, that's just uh, if your bench is full and your opponent's bench is full, you can draw up to ten cards. So uh, that's pretty powerful. We also have one Lysandre just to get uh, bench dwellers into the active and knock them out, such as Blastoise and uh, all those guys that don't appreciate getting dragged out. Um, we also have 4N just to disrupt hands, draw cards, everything like that. Two, four Juniper to um, make sure that we can draw cards. We also have a Life Dew, which is uh, a decent A spec uh, if this Pokemon is knocked out. Your opponent takes one fewer prize cards. So, um, if you if you attach it to Caterpie or Mill Tank, your opponent's gonna be denied a prize. If you attach it to Brazilian, it's like uh, Brazilian turns into a non EX and they take one prize. So, it's pretty good if you're um, about to like lose and you have the opportunity to get the knockout for the win. Slap a life due on your mill tank, the mill tank gets knocked out, you attack with something else, good game, you won. Uh, the only downside of that is it can be scrapped by Tool Scrapper or Starting Megaphone, so got the pros and the cons. Uh, we also have two mu muscle bands to add 20 damage to every attack. We have two silver bangle to d add 30 damage if it's attacking an EX and it's not an EX, so we can't attach that to Brazilian. So, um, for the energy, just six grass, four DCE. Um, the grass, you just need one colorless energy for Meltank's attack. So you just attach that, get Butterfree out, and you're hitting for 80. And then Dredagon needs a DC, so we run four. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this deck review. I am Ghostbuster from Team Plaza's Finest, and uh, I'll see you guys in the battle video.